Hey guys, welcome back. Scotty's back here at Barbecue. Today we're doing an unboxing. We have here, oh. Check this out, folks. Finally got it. Blackstone 17 inch electric griddle. Has 13 and a half inch by 16 and a half inch cooking area. 222 and three quarters square inch cooking surface. Goes up to 550 degrees. I'm gonna do an unboxing video here, folks. All right, so bear with me, it's my first one. Here we go. All right. Got some of these cool utensils to go with. the old rubber mat for making the eggs. Also got a mat. Right side up on. Usual manual. Manual, folks. Read it. Alright. Your lid should snap right on the back here. Oh yeah. This thing's pretty sturdy. A little tray here goes right on the back. Alright. That's the owner's manual. Tell you how to put it together, all that stuff. Please read that, folks. Wow, look at that, folks. Came right off. Smooth. Smooth, folks. Pretty smooth. <clears throat> right at the cord here. Whoa, look at how many times they tied this up. Wow. Holy moly, folks. I'll have to fast forward this part. Let me plug this in back here. <clears throat> Cord's pretty good. Probably about three and a half feet long, standard American plug-in. Plug it in, folks. So I bring it a little closer here, folks. There we go. There you go. Raise the dial. Turns it on. Sets the temperature. Let's go to about. Wow, we're all the way up to 500. Right there, folks. 500. You push that. Hey folks, Good. we're waiting for this thing to heat up. I just want to say uh, thanks for all my new subscribers. 
I appreciate it. If you want to do me a favor, you know, comment on this corny video. My first unboxing. I don't do them because I'm not very good at them. But I'm pretty excited about this thing. Leave a comment, hit the like button. i like to say thanks again to all the new subscribers. Thank you. Okay, we'll get back to the heat All this stuff I got at Walmart.com because the Walmart our area was sold out. They had none. And we have very few Walmarts in this area, northwest Wisconsin. The nearest one for me now is 65 miles away. So I got this on Walmart.com. All the accessories you see here. I got that. Comes with some tongs. We got two spatulas for like that. Nice little mat setting on. Okay guys, I'm gonna try to do this one-handed. A little better review. Alright, we're gonna make us some French toast on here. Got it set at 350. Ideal French toast. My world famous French toast. See where we're at temperature wise. 365. These things cycle on and off. So it's gonna get hot and cold like kinda like your oven. But overall, I'm kinda digging the overall even even back in the corner. A little cool spot way back in the corners. But but it's electric way expect. We're gonna see uh how this does on French toast. Got the batter all made up. <laughs> Got six slices of Texas toast. Let's try it here, folks. Put zoom on there. Put a little butter on here. You don't need butter, it's not stick. Butter is just a flavor and thing. Spread that around here, folks. Get all these at Walmart. That's a nice little mat we set it on. We'll flip these over. A few more seconds on that side. The little egg mat's going to cool. We'll try that out. Alright. Put these babies on there. Let's see how many we can get on here, folks. Soak a few seconds here, folks. 350. I love this little thing. Great. You get four on here, I guess. Yeah, we can do two in the middle here. Let's see how they do in the middle. Check the hot spots, cold spots. Great outside when you're barbecuing. Want to make a quick breakfast? I usually use the griddle on my gasser, but don't have to worry about wasting propane. All right, we'll give them a couple minutes. We'll flip them, see how they go. All right, we'll be right back in a couple of minutes. Let's flip these over, see what they look like. Oh, look at that, folks. Beautiful. Hey, no hot spot over there, cold spot. We'll go two more minutes, folks. Check that out. They all look pretty even. No hot or cold spots. It looks pretty good. Let me get six slices of French toast on there. Alright. After two minutes we'll pull these off and we'll slap that on there and make it six eggs and see if that thing leaks or not. Alright folks. We'll be All right, right folks, back. Spend another two minutes. Pull these off. And we'll get some eggs on here. Flip these over. Oh yeah. Beautiful. Look at that, folks. Beautiful French toast. Yeah, my famous French toast. The recipe for this famous French toast will be down in the show me more description. Let me put a little powdered sugar on there. Put a little syrup on that. Yeah. Let's move on to the eggs, folks. Get this baby on there. Set that right there. 
put a little butter on each one of these. Butter for flavor, non-stick. It does recommend maybe spraying the sides a little bit with some oil. Hang on, folks, we'll go get some eggs. There we go, folks. My bed out way. Check that out, folks. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, broke one yolk, though. They put some salt and pepper on there. Let's give it a try here. Look at that, folks. Well, if you use extra large eggs, it'd be a little better. Boy, this thing definitely not stick. Well, got a little hot there, folks, from the bottom. Yeah, I probably left them on too long, but I'm not a short order cook. So. Right, overall, looks overall worked pretty good. I don't mind that. Oh yeah, look at that! Perfect, folks. Beautiful. Oh yeah, look at that, folks. Slide right around. There you go, breakfast on the Blackstone. Let's try a burger for lunch today. We'll come right back with that burger. Hang on, folks. All right, folks, we fired it up to 500 degrees. Put some burgers on here. Let's see where we're at. Five thirty-five, five hundred, five hundred one. It's right around five hundred. <clears throat> Pretty even all over the thing here. Close to five hundred. Remember, these things will cycle on and off. Yeah, let's throw these burgers on. backyard where I'm growing smoke. In yeah, about five more minutes we'll take them off. There we pull these off. Slapping on the bed. There we go. Clean up as a breeze. Just shove everything towards the back. Out the back there. Get it with a sponge. Turn that off. 
hold that button down, shuts it off. There we go. <clears throat> yeah, folks, we made a whole complete thing there. We got French toast, my famous French toast. We got some eggs, we got some burger. Got a whole meal here. Did a good job, folks. I love this little grill. Hey, it ain't the best unboxing video, but I hope you appreciate it. This thing's just great. <laughs> Check it out one more time, folks. Got all that stuff. So everything I got, I'll put in the Walmart description box in the bottom. Hope you enjoy this, and thanks for watching. <laughs>